That was so sweet and supportive. I love it. Song that uh, is one of the first things I ever posted on Hit Record, and this was before it was a community, before it was a production company. It was just this little site where I was like putting stuff up. And um, I woke up that day in Thailand. I went to sleep in LA, and uh, it's because I, I've been in Thailand celebrating my 26th birthday with my brother Dan. And uh, yeah. And uh, this was the birthday. Now, he recorded been up for a couple of years with just some videos, pictures of assholes, and Sparkle, if you think. Shiver Town's ready. And um, I hadn't yet really articulated, though, what he recorded, the words kind of meant to me. And so Dan and I had decided, like, for my 26th birthday, I was going to go visit him in Thailand because he was living there for like half a year or something. Um, and, and we were, you know, I had been writing what it meant to me, and I had, been, I had made this video about Hit Record, and it was called Hit Record 1, which uh, isn't on our site anymore because it had a De La Soul song and a Jean Luc Godard movie in it. But, um, uh, so I, I had done all this stuff, but like, okay, here's what Hit Record is, and then I got to Thailand and we, we hung out in his uh, bamboo hut, which had Wi Fi. <laughs> and, uh, and, um, and he helped me like take all the stuff that I made and, and put it together and, and put it online as, as kind of a new version of Hit Record. It wasn't long after that that you know we put up the message board, and then soon after that we put up a bigger website, and then soon after you know years later now here we are doing this. But um, but that night after I had done this trip, turned 26 in Thailand. Um, you know, in between while we were doing all that work, we would also like hang out, spit fire. And, play music, and one of the songs we listened to was actually on the T-Ferris computer, and it's this Sesame Street song, um, and uh, I Don't Want to Live on the Moon, it's called, and, uh, yeah, it, you know, it was really appropriate back then, because, well, I'd been in Thailand, and I'd come back to LA, so it was kind of a perfect thing, coming home from a strange land. The song's sort of taken on a, a, a new meaning to me now, now that, uh, my brother met his maker that fall, um, last fall, and I, I start to think of it now not as moon, the moon as, as Thailand so much as like starting to think that maybe where we are now, all of us, you know, with our number of days in these bodies, we're sort of living on the moon, and um, and like my brother went home, so. Uh, yeah, without any further ado, uh, are we recording? Yeah. Well, I'd like to visit the moon In a rocket ship high in the air Yes, I'd like to visit the moon but I don't think I want to stay there Though I'd like to look down on the earth from above I'll miss all the places and people I love So although I might stay there for one afternoon I don't want to live on the Places that I'd like to be 
Thank you. 